Hey guys, welcome back for another episode of Hawkeye Bass. And today we have a couple hours. We're going to be fishing the Des Moines River below Sailorville, the Sailorville Spillway. Uh, it's pretty cold outside. I think it's like 39, but I've heard the walleye are biting good down here. I never catch any good walleye down here, but hopefully that will change today. So let's get out and let's give it a try. All right, guys, so I'm just trying to get a couple quick drone shots before we go down there. I'm waiting for this baby to warm up. Taylorville Dam, it's located just north of Des Moines, kind of west of Ankeny. But yeah, here, let's let's lift off. Let's see if we can get some video here. A little bit of wind today, but I'm not too worried about it. So that fun is over. Uh, I apologize for any wind noise we might be getting today. Hopefully we're kind of out of the wind down on these rocks here. Uh, what I'm starting off with today, I'm going for walleye today. So I got just a double jig set up here. I got two eighth ounce jigs, one with a little swim bait on it and one with a chartreuse twister tail. Uh, we don't have too much time today. Got some stuff going on tonight. My little brother has a basketball game. But we're gonna give it a few hours here. Well, maybe a couple hours. My hands are freezing unless they're biting then I'll be here all night but let's find ourselves a good rock here this one seems fitting all right guys so let's uh, take the first cast this isn't my usual walleye spot my usual walleye spot is the Iowa River but it was too far of a drive and I only had like I said a few hours today so we decided to give this a chance I've caught some giant wiper some big white bass, some big catfish, pretty much big everything down here except for a walleye. So let's see if we can break that little curse and land ourselves a nice little walleye today. All right, guys, update. It's been about a half hour. I can't feel my fingers, and this line I have on here is old and just complete trash. But we are still chugging along. I did have one white bass off the of camera. It wasn't very big, probably 13, 14 inches. Uh, we have switched to a a little lipless crank here we're trying to go for some wiper white bass because man i don't trust myself while i fishing with this line right now on my luck i'll get a freaking eight pounder on and it'll just bust this line right away all right update two i just about two minutes after i turned that camera off i was throwing that lipless crank i got in something really really big um i don't know if i accidentally snagged a carp or something or a big flathead or something, but I mean it was giant. About spooled me and then broke it off. So there goes a solid six or seven bucks. We are switching back to the jigs now. I'm gonna do a little double rig here. And we're gonna go fish up by the wall, right by the spill. And if we don't catch anything, we are going to get out of here and go get those packages mailed for you guys. I'm gonna get them out today no matter what. Unless the fish are really biting, then it's going to have to wait till tomorrow. Hey guys, we are calling it a day for fishing anyways. I got broke off again by another big fish. I don't know if I was snagging them, but that last one felt like a big wiper. So we just didn't come prepared today. We didn't have the right line, I didn't have the right gear. I didn't have gloves, I didn't have a hat. Well, I had the old bucket hat, but that was about it. So we kind of came unprepared today, but we're gonna get home. We're gonna mail out those packages to you guys for the giveaway. And then we're gonna be going over my new giveaway. I need some perspective from you guys on what you want. We're gonna do kind of a custom giveaway. 
I'm gonna put a few things up for vote and you actually vote on what you want me to give away for the Christmas giveaway and we will get on the walleye soon we're gonna go home gear up and hopefully head out this week to a couple of my good walleye spots not Sailorville Dam if you're around the Des Moines area Iowa area do not ever put faith in catching a nice walleye at Sailorville it's just not gonna happen most of the time but Anyways guys, let's go get that stuff mailed out and we will talk about the giveaway later. Alright guys, so we are on the way home now. Uh, I have like a 40 minute drive so I figured I would just kind of come on here and kind of welcome the new people to my channel. I know, I, uh, you know I've gotten like 300 in the last month which is awesome thank you guys so much for that uh, but anyways my name's ryan uh, i'm based out of central iowa i live in story city iowa so i'm about 40 minutes north of the capital which is des moines and i basically fish a little bit of everything uh, i kind of specialize in bass in the summer and then i kind of switch to walleye in the spring and fall i do a ton of ice fishing and this year we actually have a trip booked at lake of the woods on the Minnesota side and I think we're going to South Dakota so we're gonna be doing a lot of ice fishing too so but anyways guys I basically started this YouTube channel for it's almost like a living picture like I, I used to love taking pictures of all the fish I caught but you know a picture is only so much a video shows a whole experience shows you know the catch the release I mean everything about it the whole process so I basically started YouTube not to make money not to Get a bunch of free fishing stuff i made it to make kind of a living picture for me and for everyone else to enjoy so anyways guys we're going to finish up this drive and then we are going to talk about the christmas giveaway i'm going to be giving away probably two or three things and they're going to be good prizes and we're going to do a little vote on that or you guys can suggest suggest down below in this video what you'd like to see given away do you want a you want a new combo you want a new pole you want a new reel uh do you want an ice fishing setup me to get a couple ice fishing poles and some tungsten and jigs so you you put down below what you'd like to see in a giveaway make it reasonable obviously i can't give away a boat all right guys so we just got everything dropped off at the post office i think i have a couple packages here that i forgot that fell out of the box I will find those and I'll ship them out. Uh, hopefully just today I'll run back up there again today or they'll be shipped tomorrow. Uh, today I think is the 29th of November when this was filmed. I think it's going to take me a couple days to get this up. So you should be expecting those packages within a week, I would think. Uh, I shipped them as cheap as I could. It ended up being like $76. So next time we're going to do less prizes, but we're going to do higher valued prizes, you know, just to make up for that shipping cost. And then we'll do another one with a bunch of different items too because I like doing those because it gets more people involved more people can win but for the Christmas giveaway we're going to do two or three things I guess um, why don't you comment down below let's make it you know a 80 or below hopefully or we can do one big one let me know if you want one big one or three in that 50 to $100 range we can do three of those or one big one I mean we can give away GoPro if you want to do that so put down below in this video what you want in the giveaway and we will get back to you with some fishing videos we're going to my hot spot for walleyes in two days so expect a video from that we're going to catch walleye there i can guarantee it and hopefully getting some pike as well so if you watch this thank you sorry it was kind of boring but i hope you enjoyed the drone shots and also get, leave me some feedback on the drone shots as well do you like those all right guys we will see you next time